I mean, obviously, it, it's public knowledge that the reason that you know our dynasty team, yeah. you know, the you know Karma uh, Formal, and you two like broke up was because of personal reasons and personal issues. Do you think that could I have done more as Hector? As, the, as could I have done more to to talk to mm. to you know to Seth and to talk to Matt? I think we're all at a point where like no one was listening to anyone. Um, Like everyone's like egos were like out of control. Um, I'm trying to just, I mean, I I, like, I really don't believe, or I like in game ultimately like costed us the, uh, like the team pretty much. Like I think if we, if we won season one, we still might be a team. Or maybe, maybe like, like we'd probably have to win one more event that year for yeah. things to stay because it was so like, like I always think like if it's really bad, like personal reasons or per- personal issues, but if yeah. you're winning, then it makes up for it. Uh, but I mean, probably not. I think that was all on us Yeah, to be honest with you. I think everyone was to a point where like our egos were out of control. we were, everyone was lazy. That was, to me, that was the biggest thing. It was just like the blatant, like disrespect from, for each other's time f- from for each other's time for each other's like i don't know not opinions but like it was just i don't know and, and i think it was all amplified by us just losing yeah losing dallas i think that was the biggest thing if we won dallas we probably win another event that year uh but and i mean the choke at dallas is i think the choke at dallas was worse than the choke at uh season one by far i mean we had we had like a two f- I think it was like 230 to like 150 lead. Yeah. Lost Arden's Force Hard Point. Yep. We had a 5 2 lead or 5 1 lead in SD. Then ended up getting two sets of streaks. Ended up losing that. And then I, I think the CTF we lost by like one cap. Yeah. But we got 3 0 but that was like the closest, most important series of the whole year. Yeah. So, and, and that was winner's finals at Dallas, first event. Yeah. So, you know, I, one of the conversations I had with, um, who was it? And, and one of the one of the old teammates, you know, because obviously you you're you're like me. You have a very very strong personality. You're not afraid to speak truths or you know hold back because you know fuck fuck someone's feelings if we're both trying to succeed in this thing, yeah. right? Like, it, it, you know, mm-hmm. we're we're here to win, yeah. and you're doing something wrong. I'm gonna call you out because yeah, yeah. you know why? Just in case you don't fucking know. Yeah. Right. Um, and and one of the players that that I don't remember which one it was, but I told him like I'm like yo, you, you got to listen, you know this this dude knows what you know knows, yeah, yeah. knows what the fuck he's talking about. He oh, wins, know you know he's about, he, yeah. he's been winning. Just just fucking take that in the chin, man. Just yeah. fucking say yeah, you know what you're right. Just fucking do yourself yeah. a favor and 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 just say whether you disagree or not. Yeah. Someone's won more than the other. Yeah. Okay. And the other that that person that's won more is Krim. Mm-hmm. Just listen. Well, yeah. The the way I I mean I know what you're talking about and. Like we gotta be careful on this to yeah no no yeah, I'm not no yeah, it wasn't yeah. an, it wasn't a bad thing yeah well it's just like the way I see it on a team especially in, in Call of Duty right if everyone is on the same page doing the wrong play yeah that team is better than the team that's on not on the same page doing the right play yeah hundred like a hundred percent of the time if you are not anchoring at all but you're all pushing the front from like a team push like the front of a hill for like a team push, you're probably going to win that game if the other team is not like, if, if the other team is doing all sorts of different things. And we were not on the same page in yeah. World War II uh, after we made the roster change. Yeah. So. And then obviously things, things have to change. Do you, obviously, you know, like I, I, and, 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 and Seth knows this too. And, and I, you know, we talk about this like nonstop, you know, had, had he been more willing to, to move out of the situation that he was in where the yeah. shitty internet and just I think I I think if he did that we probably wouldn't have broke up either. Yeah. So, you think that that, that yeah. obviously happened? I mean I mean he had a, he had like a 3 month window to do it and after that point there's like no coming back. Yeah. So and he just yeah. didn't do it. What a shitty fucking year we had, huh? Yep. 2018 can get the fuck out of here <laughs> today. You know, if, if today is Forget December 31st, thank God because tomorrow's <laughs> a new year and hallelujah. Like yeah. I'm not I'm literally going to pretend like 2018 never never ever ever happened, bro. Cuz it